It's time for Everton away. Welcome back to West Ham official. Hope you are all well. You join me for another match day vlog as we set the trip up to Goodison Park to take on Everton. Of course, we've reignited our creative spark on uh, Monday night against Brentford with Paqueta back in the side, and that should give us some confidence going into this game. Everton, they've had their uh, decent bit of news this week with their points deduction being reduced from 10 points to 6 points, so that should uh, result in a bouncing Goodison Park today, getting behind uh, their side. So say today it's a Friday night uh, of course you wouldn't want me starting the vlog tomorrow morning very early it's an early wake up call and hopefully it's all going to be worth it so further ado, I'm going to get some kip we're going to get up early tomorrow and hopefully see West Ham pick up three points let's go come on you irons good morning it is match day and it is snowing <laughs> this is going to be one interesting journey come on you irons <laughs> And we have arrived in Frankly Services. <laughs> Hello, mate. We're on our way to Frankly Services, don't you know? Uh, the last two times we were here, Liverpool Man United, we lost. Um, is that going to change today? I felt quietly confident, mate. Yeah? You know, the first 20 minutes on Monday were just a, so a level of football that we haven't seen for seemingly eternity. Exactly. So I think... I yeah, said one in the car, I'm going to be a bit more confident than that, mate. I think yeah. we could get a couple, get one early, two near West Ham. So, oh, I'm yeah. on new irons. Let's get into Frankly. Here we go. And just like that, we have arrived in Liverpool. I usually do this on the walk, but it's absolutely tipping it down. So we're preparing ourselves for the weather conditions and we're going to now head to Goodison Park. We've got about two and a bit hours until kickoff. Let's do this, West Ham. Come on, you irons. We've opted for the McDonald's for lunch mayo chicken. Looking rather bleak. Terry, what have you got, mate? Quarter pounder with cheese. Let's have a look. It appears so. There we go. Ah, oh, look at it, mate. Bosh. The Everton away, Everton away, here we go. Oh, it's Inside Goodison, West Ham are unchanged from our victory against Brentford on Monday night. So Zuma uh, keeps his space in the side, uh, which is a little bit of a surprise. But apart from that, it is what we expected. West Ham unchanged, less than an hour until kickoff. The atmosphere is building. Come on, you Irons. Kickoff is upon us here on a live New Goodison Park. Come on, you irons, let's get to it. <laughs> Starting to grow into it a little bit more, 15 minutes gone. We have this fantastic winding stretch, but it's still nil-nil. 
Boys who fell. Boom! Before half time, VAR checks for a handball for Zuma. Oh, for Zariola, take a bow. What a save. Get in, get in. Half time at Goodison Park. Everton nil, West Ham nil, some drama towards the back end of the first half. Look, my gut instinct was it wasn't a penalty. I've seen the replay, his arm does go out. So, probably the fair decision made by VAR, but what a save from Alphonse Ariola. The away end went mental. I think a draw so far is probably a fair reflection of things. We haven't been great, they haven't been great. No cutting edge in that final third. Pretty poor. 45 minutes of football, which was expected. Let's hope we can find that quality in the second half to bring up all three points. Come on, you Irons. Here with former West Ham player Ian Bishop. Ian, what did you make of that first half, mate? Uh, very, very fortunate to go in level, to be honest with you. But seeing the, the way the game started and the two managers and the way they set up, I think it had nil nil written or all over it. But I would take a draw right now, and I think both managers would. Fair enough. Ian, thank you. Very welcome. Thank you. Come on, Bowen. Go on. Go on. Oh. Everton have started the second half for better, but Bowen just had the ball and meandered his way through. Couldn't quite get a shot off. 53 minutes gone. Still nil nil. Bowen's oh, on fire. So easy, 1-0 Everton, so easy, defensively poor again, don't close the man down, don't mark in the box, good header, good goal, 1-0 Everton, go on, get up, yes, 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 Saves has kept us in this. <laughs> Some brilliant <laughs> saves. We're almost down 20 Eight minutes to go. Golden chance for Kudus. He was haggled well by the defenders. Getting closer, it's still 1 1. Whatever we do, we just can't seem to get that final ball in to get that second. Come on, West Ham, last post 15 to go. Two minutes of normal time to go, and I think we're fair in saying we've been fortunate. They've had so many chances ever and have failed to convert. We could nick it here. Come on, West Ham. We could nick it here. 
we could make it in. West Ham. Could be about three minutes left. Just defend this. Come on. Oh, and there we go. What a final 10 minutes that was. Apologies if you can't see me. I'm trying my best. But well, Everton won. West Ham United 3. Honestly, I don't know how we won that football match. But honestly, I'm not complaining whatsoever. Those scenes at the end were absolutely brilliant. Uh, and a sign of a United fan base there. You know, we that was brilliant. Absolutely sensational today. What an away day. And I hope that I've documented it well for you guys at home as well. If you enjoyed this video, drop a like on it. Subscribe to the channel. It's a much needed confidence going in to our European games now absolutely brilliant look we weren't fantastic but we grinded it out we stuck with Everton today and we managed to pick up those three points and who doesn't like two goals in the last five minutes limbs uh, to take all three points because believe me I don't mind it one bit thanks for watching drop a like subscribe and I will see you soon come on you irons get in